For the first time, we are bringing our free art tour across the river to New Jersey, and our first stop is one that you could actually see from Lower Manhattan. It's called Water Soul, and it's a new permanent fixture here on Newport Pier in Jersey City. Created by Spanish artist Jama Plensa, the sculpture resembles a woman with her eyes closed, shushing pedestrians walking around her. It stands 80 feet high, and it's the artist's tallest creation yet. He said Water Soul is asking us for a little bit of silence. It is asking us to listen to its profound voice that speaks to us about the origin of the world and its memory. He also says his wish is that Water Soul becomes an icon for Newport and a landmark that visually connects it with New York City. We can't talk about art in Jersey City without featuring one of their many murals. This one is called Together by Jason Naylor. Jason said the idea behind the mural is when we put our hands together, everything is possible. There is no limit what we can do when we join hands. It just requires that we work together. This mural premiered during the Jersey City Mural Fest last June. There are over 100 murals throughout Jersey City. You can find this mural on Monmouth Street right near the corner of 13th. And finally, if you've seen fence art in Jersey City, it's probably the work of Norman Kirby. Norman wanted to make several beautiful pieces of art to be displayed outside in the open. He wanted to create something on a public domain that wouldn't damage or deface the property and could be taken down if needed. The fence art installations are constructed with eco-friendly materials. The recycled fabric is dyed to the desired color and reused to create something that positively impacts the community. In 2018, Norman was acknowledged for his installations and actually received an award for public art from the Jersey City Arts Council. This particular installation is located on the fences around the historic Hudson and Manhattan Railroad powerhouse. So there you have it, three ways to see free art in Jersey City.